Hi everyone, this is Jackie Reed with Keller Williams Success Realty, and I'm here with my stager, Wendy Bilek from Amazing Staging. Hey Wendy. Hi. Yes, and my marketing plan, um, when I list a home, Wendy's a big part of it, and she's um, the very next step. After I meet with my sellers and they're thinking of selling or they're going to sell or we're not gonna sell for a year, I always say the very next step is to get Wendy out because Wendy does an extensive um, staging consultation with my clients, the very first meeting. And uh, Wendy, maybe you could talk about what, why is staging important? Yeah, well, you know, staging obviously is to me one of the most important things you can do in the marketing plan that you have. So. Um, in the minimum, you know, I would do a consultation and what I do then is basically um, go out to the property and I'll um, have you take some notes and go over room to room and we'll talk about, you know, decluttering, depersonalizing, how to arrange your furniture, what updates to make, um, things like that so we can appeal to the masses. And that's the thing you have to really take a look at is who is the target market for this house, for your house? So with that, you know, we really got to make sure that we are gearing it towards them um, to make it more appealing and, you know, be at the top of your game. And with the consultation first, um, a lot of times I'll give you ideas that you can save money with, but will get the same impact um, and you can at least get, have time to do them. You know, sometimes people have little lists, some people have big lists. So it all depends, but we certainly want to get you on uh, the market as quickly as we can but make sure that everything is done um it needs to be done oh and i so agree because first impression is everything the staging the photography just when you put it out there on the internet that's mm -hmm. what's going to either grab a buyer to want to see the home or not and i've had so many people say i don't want to see that home i didn't like those pictures oh mm -hmm. there's too much stuff everywhere and it's like it's unfortunate because i've seen the home and they, it is a nice house so um, sometimes I have to talk people into going and seeing a home, which I shouldn't because it's yeah. presented correctly. It's hard for most people to see past those. I know I've seen many pictures online that have boxes stacked up in a room or the picture is dark, um, things right. like that. That doesn't look appealing to me. I don't know about you. But oh, right. So, I mean, I don't get excited about boxes in a room. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, and Wendy, you also. Um, do several staging steps. So the very first step after meeting with me is to have Wendy out for the consultation. Usually it's about an hour to two hours the yeah. most. And um, mm -hmm. like you said, you go room to room. Then the very next step would be to come back out right when you're about to get the home on the market and for pictures, or I do professional photography, and um, you come back out to do what? Uh, basically, make sure everything is ready and looks good for pictures. And if uh, the home needed some, let's say, updated decor and things like that, then I would uh, bring some stuff out and decorate for you, basically, and put things up. I do that with vacant houses, too. Um, we call it light staging, and that makes a huge difference. So, um, you know, you really want to be up to date as possible, you know, as much up to date as possible when you're um, you know, going against other listings too. We don't want you to sit on the market and get stale. So it's really important to actually uh, do the things on the list that I recommend um, if you wanna sell fast and get more money. Oh, definitely. Yeah, the light staging is important because I've learned my lesson. I have one listing that was vacant and they did everything you suggested and I'm like, wow, it looks really nice. Well, maybe I don't need to get Wendy out there because I was trying to rush it on the market myself. I mean, this was a couple of years ago. And um, long story short, I was like, darn it, I should have had Wendy do the light staging too. So she came back out, put the uh, little trinkets or whatever I call you say, like vases or- Decor uh, items. Yeah, little, mm -hmm. yeah, like pictures, whatever, throughout the home. And wow, what a difference. Because when you're showing it in person, Vacant rooms are very boring, but then when you mm -hmm. add the, you add character, I should say, to it, yeah. where it makes it really mm -hmm. and it actually helps your eye look at the room better, and that somehow is like magic. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to get excited about a room that has nothing in it. 
definitely. Oh, it's boring. It's boring. It's like, yeah. oh, this is a bedroom. Okay, this is yeah. a bedroom, you know. Well. Yeah, and with vacant listings, too, I also offer virtual staging where I inject furniture into the photos that you have done. And this way they can kind of get an idea of how the room could be set up, um, you know, what you could do with it, how it could look, how you can arrange it, things like that. So that's really helpful too, because most people have a hard time visualizing um, how things will fit in the space and how the space will look. So um, virtual staging is another important part too to do with a vacant house. And yeah, you just do mainly the main rooms, you know, like. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't mean to focus on every little room and I won't be decorating every little wall. I mean, I really focus on what's the main photo going to look like. So you're kind of looking at it like that saying, okay, this is the main shot. What does, what do I see? So I really focus on that and decorate um, to that effect. And another question is, does it cost a lot of money to stage? And what? No, not with me. Not with you. <laughs> well, anyway, That's what I mean. You know, for, for, for people say it's like thousands of dollars. I'm like, oh gosh, no. It's a few hundred. No. But it depends on what your house is um, already at before. You yeah, I mean, not everybody's going to need to update and put money into it that way. Um, some people just need help with the little things here and there, like fixtures, stuff like that. So that's, I'm going to try to keep it down to a minimum as much as we can, but the actual staging of getting me in there and uh, doing a consultation and then um, also helping with the core is not thousands of dollars by a long shot. So, not um, all. In fact, yeah, we're talking, you know, about $500 yeah. um, on average, I would say, or less. Yeah, it depends if they have the consult and the staging and then yeah. um, what services that you need. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Well, the one thing I've been doing with anyone who lives with me, I include all that in my um, marketing plan. That's so, awesome. Yeah, which most people don't. But, you know, it, to me, it's worth, you know, I always say you have to spend money to make money. And in order to get people to move, in order to get them sold quickly, you have to. <laughs> I came from yeah, and we've seen it. Yeah, so. we've seen the results. So I mean, it works. It does work because I've been and working. And change what works. Oh yeah, since 2010, you've been doing staging for me, and yeah. I'll tell you, I, people even ask, "What's your secret? How do you get your listing sold so fast?" Hello. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm a part of it. I'm just a part of it, but a big part a of big it. A big part of it. Yep, definitely. Yeah. You have to have a great agent like Jackie Reed. So. Oh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I think that's pretty much it. Um, anything else we can think yeah. of? Or? To be brief. So it's just, uh, you know, yeah, I just get me in there sooner than later. Um, yeah. So if you know if you're going to sell, um, definitely get me in ahead of time so you can begin to work on the things that I will, uh, you know, want you to do. And uh, then you'll be on the market sooner. Yes. And actually talking about that, I've had many sellers calling me in, me in now to list next year well this is the time to get wendy out and then after she's done they always say wow we should have had her out a long time ago because now we want to enjoy our house instead of him yeah to right <laughs> yeah a lot of them want me to come decorate the next house too so <laughs> i do yeah definitely which i will i will hey i offer that service as well so <laughs> oh yeah it's not just limited to listings you know it's for people who want to also enjoy their home too and I've had yeah and the goal is you know the goal is to you know sell quickly and make as much as possible and you take my tips um uh with minimal cost we can get you there oh because one thing you do is offer like okay if i with the consult you know if you replace this with this and you can get it for this and it's very inexpensive and you help them Items. Yeah, yeah, I, I can help you. I'd rather have uh, me give you some ideas because I pretty much know what's on trend. And I do a lot of research as far as uh, getting things that look great that cost, you know, not a lot of money. Exactly. Well, I do appreciate you, Wendy. And Thank I'm you. glad you were here to be on this uh, little Zoom interview with me. But um, if anybody's looking to sell or even wants to get Wendy out because you want to join your new home, you know, <laughs> call mm -hmm. me. I can definitely get us started and uh, I can also present my marketing plan of the next steps as well. So with that, thanks for joining and nice uh, for tuning in. Take care. Thank you.
Bye. Thanks, Bye. Jackie.